clubs, adult arcades, any adult business you can think of may soon be able to set up shop in Roswell. The Roswell City Council is having a special hearing this week to consider an ordinance that would allow sexually oriented businesses in the city. News 13's Emily Younger is live in Roswell to talk about the possible change. Kim, right now adult oriented businesses are not allowed in Roswell, but that could soon change. Well, I don't like it for the fact that it's just Roswell's not that kind of town. 28 year old Kimberly Seaman has lived in Roswell her entire life. She says her hometown has a set of values that adult businesses don't align with. I don't like it. It's because Roswell's built on Christian values and as a mother of a four year old daughter, I don't want her growing up thinking that's like what's expected of her. But city planner Michael Vickers says the ordinance isn't to attract adult businesses. It's to regulate them if they decide to come to Roswell. Those that are against it would stand to benefit as well because this would outline and identify the requirements that they would have to fall under to be able to do it. Those requirements include a long list of rules. One would make it impossible for these businesses to be located in Roswell's commercial district. City planner Vickers says with this ordinance, sexually oriented businesses can only go up on industrial land, which means they must be at least 750 feet away from any public building like schools and churches, leaving only two sites in Roswell available, Petro Park and the Air Center. It does not prevent them, but it is pretty rigorous as far as what they're required to comply with. Even with the rules, Seaman says she's worried about the people these businesses might attract. There's that where there's stuff where they can get these books, they can get the movies, and go see women do that. It's just going to make them look at children more. Now I spoke with a few city council members today and they told me they don't mind the idea of allowing these adult businesses into Roswell as long as there are some regulations. But no one is saying if anyone has expressed interest in opening an adult oriented business here. Back to you. Okay, thanks Emily. Now the city council meeting is set for Friday evening. The public will be able to comment.